going on back here for another beautiful day of detailing this time around again of course that's what we do and uh today's challenge is a first for clean steam pros we got this here motor home the fr3 by forest river uh it's gonna do a good wash and steam clean on the outside to see how let's get it cleaned up he's taking it out soon this is the shade inside one kind of excited about you know being able to work in the shade out here but yeah it's really just decent cleaning up you know a good wash getting all that stuff and everything you know wheels are actually not that bad but you know get them cleaned up yeah so <clears throat> Pretty much regular, schmegular stuff. Oh, let me see if I can get this golf cart moved out of my way. You know, if you're messing with my angle, because I can't set the camera up so y'all can get this beautiful footage that I know you love so much. But um, hey, on that note, I think I got everything already set up. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead, put this camera down, and get to work. pretty much that basically and i think what i'm gonna do is start on the back end and we're pretty much all the ends that directly in the sun get that part out of the way so i can finish up on the front end and this side where it's nice and shaded and whatnot so i think that's a good idea that's the way i'm gonna do this so um but the overall plan is how i'm going to attack this uh as i was saying of course, I'm gonna foam it down, and rinse it, and then I think when I apply the wax, use the steam to apply the wax in that final wipe down, and uh, see what kind of finish we come up with. You just gotta be careful around the caulking. I did uh, look that up, so as long as I uh, yeah, push the pressure washer straight into there, I think that was what I had researched and read, but yeah, getting it figured out, coming along, as long as I take my time, pay attention to what I'm doing. It's gonna work out, it's gonna work out this time. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and get back to work now.
Alright, I'm done. I'm gonna uh, start on the, this side because, you know, real tight. Don't got a good camera view, but you can see them wheels though. Yeah, this joint cleaned up nice. Don't know if I uh, got caught in the video because I think I forgot to press record one time. But uh, the owner's happy. I've got a little something right here. That's all. <sighs> owner's happy, came back, checked it out, liked everything. So he's gonna uh, refer us to a friend of his who was basically, you know how I go, let me, let me see how I work out on you. And then, you know, work out good, give me a call. So, got that, but yeah, everything turned out very well, I think. Whole thing came out very good. Um, yeah, so, yeah, wasn't nearly as bad as I thought. Um, I didn't get through it as efficiently as I wanted to. But, you know, this is, like I said, first time cleaning the RV. But um, I got an idea of how I wanna, you know, wanna do the next time probably save and get it done again probably at the end of the summer early fall for the you know for the winter so we're gonna get it cleaned up again um yeah next time we're gonna uh, actually get on on top of the roof clean the roof off um on uh machine polish that's the word those are the words that i was looking for we're gonna machine polish and everything try to bring that shine out a little bit more but uh yeah. that's that and i will catch y'all on the next video